Hey guys, this is Archer and Clay Movie Reviews, and I'm reviewing The Artist. Okay, so I'm going to read the plot for you guys off uh, Rotten Tomatoes. Okay. Hollywood 1927, that's when it takes place. George Valentine is a silent film movie superstar. The advent of the advent of the talkies will sound their the death knell of his character and see him fall into the oblivion. For young extra Peppy Miller, it seems the sky's the limit. Major movie stardom awaits. The artist tells the story of an interlinked destiny. It's got a running time of an hour and 40 minutes, PG-13. Came out in theaters November 25th. Okay, so the cast, um, I'm reading off IMDb now. Jean D. Guardin, sorry if I get these wrong. Pierre Bingo as Pepe, and the first one was George. John Goodman from Roseanne. Um, those were the first couple. There was um, Malcolm McDonald from Halloween. Dr. Loomis, the remake, and Spongebob, Bill Fagerbait, back, <laughs> sorry if I get those wrong, but those are the ones that stood out to me. The directing was really awesome, I liked how he made it feel like we were all the way back in 1927, I think, Ni 1929, and I liked the way the feel and how today 2012 that we could have a silent black and white film and this was my first black and white film and I really enjoyed it like it was really good the acting was wonderful this um I don't know the way I don't know how I even stayed focused on it because you know I'm ADD I have ADD and I'm like you know so I really liked it it was funny it had romance, it had drama, it had all those. Um, and the critics liked it and the audience. And I think it should get an Oscar because it was that good. And I'm not like amazed by it, but I really enjoyed it. Okay, so we're going to go to my mom and my sister who watched it. They have some mixed reviews about this. So here are their reviews. We are here with my mom and my sister, Beth and Kara Patterson. Okay. So I'm going to start out with Kara, which had a totally different different opinion and point of view from me. So here's her. Here is hers. I didn't like the movie personally. Um so I ended up getting I I watched it halfway through and that's all I watched. And she left. And then my mom, what was your review? Um, I watched it on and off as I was looking at a magazine, so it was kind of, uh, I could have watched it, I couldn't have watched it, but, um, then when I was done with my magazine, I watched the end of the movie, and it, it ended pretty good, so, it was okay, silent movies aren't for me. Was this your first silent movie? Yeah. What, how about you? Yeah. So is mine. And I really liked how they made this in 2011 and made it seem like it was back in the 20s through 30s. Okay, so that was their reviews. Thank you for watching. Check my channel for more reviews from me. Thanks.